okay what's up everybody it's me erica so we're gonna do a video real quick i'm telling y'all it don't take long to do these damn scarf videos so let me do it all right so this is a scarf that i got from sahara sahara head wraps um it's an oblong scarf this is what i use oblong works better for me um usually i do them a little wider than this but depending on how big your head is um I have a big head, right? So I need a long scarf. This is not stretchy. I like stretchy material because you can, if you can, it can conform or you know wrap to your head the right way and stay. It stays tighter. Um, this doesn't have any stretch to it, but it still wraps good and it's still the right kind of you know um, material. I mean, the right length and the right um, length and height. I guess length and width and height. All right. All right. So here it is. So what I do is I take it now, either if it's like, if you cut it off of material, like say you just grab like, a, you know, that green scarf, I told you guys it's a part of a dress. So it, the way that I cut it wasn't super even. So I kind of fold it down so it can have an even, you know, look on the back of my head. Right. So I fold it down. All right. So you can do that. All right. Fold it. Okay. Then you are going to take it around your head now I have a hook <laughs> okay I got a hook head so that might be another reason why it grabs really well but anyway so you can wrap it around your head right and you want to have one side shorter than the other because you want the long side to be the part that you wrap around that you make around your knot right so you're gonna come here I like my ears kept in some people don't I prefer my ears kept in I want my earrings to hang um, some people don't like it it's just really a matter of comfortability on whether you want your ears in or not I like my ears in very rare do I pull my ears out all right so from here you're gonna make sure that all enough material is covering your head you don't want any hair out right here right so you're gonna come here you're gonna tie make a tie right and you're gonna tie a knot or just make one tie you're not making a knot yet then you want to this is where you want to adjust it before you start wrapping shit up all right so you're gonna adjust it right here you're gonna fold any tags down if it's like you know a more material up here you can fold it down and this is gonna be okay because this is where your knot is gonna be so you're not gonna be able to see your hair now it works for me because i don't have no damn hair a lot of y'all have us got hair and shit so you might need to wrap your hair before um you know but i don't have no hair so that's why it's dumb easy for me right so from here i tied a knot i adjusted i fixed my ears sometimes i have to pull my lobes down because my lobes you know they come like this so just this is where you do your adjustments okay then I tighten it a little tighter, okay? Then I'm gonna take it and make a tie like I'm gonna tie another tie, but I'm not going to let the tail come out. So I'm gonna make a loop, right? You know how to do that. There's your loop, right? Here's your longer piece of material, okay? You're gonna take this part and you're gonna make, a. this is gonna be the little ball that you use to wrap your material around right now again if you have more material like if you have a because sometimes my scarves are longer than this so you have more material this ball right here is going to be bigger right so you're going to take it and then you're going to start wrapping your scarf around the ball right and then you are going to tuck it behind you can either tuck it behind tuck it behind or if you just want it to be like a little sloppy like you can do it like sometimes I do mine a little sloppy hold on let me do it go like this and I like just let it let the let this part hang like that tail instead of tucking it all the way in I'll like pull it out a little bit you could pull it out to make it look sloppy you can make it look sloppy sometimes you make it look sloppy i make it look sloppy it depends on what i want to do but sometimes i make it look sloppy sometimes i have it neat okay and that's one way right that's one way then there's another way so 
after you come here with the shit, you put the wrap in. Then you can take this piece, right, and twist it, right? That's how you get the little the little rolls, the little cinnamon rolls, right? You twist it, put your little knot down, and you could twist it around and then make sure you tuck it. Now, sometimes you have to measure your um your knot or your longer piece of material because sometimes you you'll start twisting it and it'll twist like it'll end in the front you kind of want it to end in the back and you don't have anything showing because you've already put the the little piece down hopefully you were able to see that but that's how you tie your scarves y'all okay and then or sometimes you could do it like this same thing just tie remember i told you i like to put it to the back that would be cute i'll have to adjust this and make it a little tighter but that's how you can you can wear it like that it can be cute like that right that's cute right that's real cute and sometimes if you have a really cute material you the way that material goes on your head you can have a, the pattern will make it look really cute and that's pretty much it so hopefully y'all learned something from me today. Take care of each other. Protect your energy. All right, peace.